you can see, it's really hot out here. And um, I don't know if you can really see that, but um, it's really hot out here. <laughs> so I'm out here with our little baby chicks. Um, and I'm gonna show you something that, this may be the, the one thing that kind of keeps you from getting baby chicks. And I really hope it doesn't because uh, we have only had them uh, not even 24 hours and we've already fallen in love with them. And so um, I hope that you don't um, not have baby chicks just for this reason. Um, so basically what I'm gonna have to do is clean our baby's poop up. Um, basically I'm cl cleaning the baby's poop hole. Uh, they call it the chick's vent. Um, and I don't know why. Oh, I, oh and I don't, can you kind of zoom in? I don't know how. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you zoom in on? I can't. On the babies. It's, I know it's kind of disgusting to, to show you this, but it kind of clogs up. Are you zoomed in? Oh, getting big mosquitoes. Okay, so you can zoom out now. One second. Okay, I know, I know. Okay, so we are going to, um, I have some warm water. You can't, I don't, you probably can't see that. And that's okay. You want me to show No, you? that's okay. Okay. Got some warm water and a paper towel. So we're basically just going to rub it on his whole. Yep, gonna kind of just. Try and get this poop unmatted from the feathers. And and I would recommend for you to do it when you first notice it. Because if it gets clogged up more, then... It can get sick, huh? Yeah, and it would be harder. So you should oh, start oh. when uh, you first see it. And from watching a video of another YouTuber, we learned it's important to put something underneath you. Um, because while doing this, uh, your chicken may get unclogged and they may end up pooping more on you. So, um, you're going to do that and let's see if I can use the dry one to maybe pull it out a little bit. Well, me and my brother thought that uh, it was just like a feather. It's stinky. Anyways, I don't. I'm not gonna video this whole process of me doing this. Um, so you can pause, you can stop it now, and we'll show you the. Okay. Egg. So we have finished up uh, cleaning this one's little bottom, and um, we decided to do this one right now. What we'll probably do is um, every morning we'll make a habit of coming out here and checking their bottoms one by one. Um, what they suggest to do is take them out and <laughs> a little photo bomber or video. video bomber. And I'm not video bombing. Ian just wants to be in the video. Part of the channel, <laughs> dude. What they okay. suggest is to is to um, there we go. Is to um, put them in a separate box that way you know you've already checked that one. And um, anyway, so let's. I'll, I'll show you. Uh, Owen, go ahead and zoom in on the final product there. The cleaned bottom vent. But, <laughs> but it's called pinky butt. I know. So much better. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Go ahead and zoom out. We're gonna put little baby chicken back, back in the, in the thing there. I was lucky I didn't get pooped on. So. And don't forget uh. to like and subscribe. That's right, and always wash your hands after you do stuff like this um, so that you stay clean and healthy and so that your chicks stay clean and healthy. So don't forget to like our videos, subscribe. If you want notifications on you ring that bell. when, that's all right, if you, if you want notifications on when we're going to post new videos, um, hit the bell next to the subscribe button and uh, we'll catch you on the flip side. Ah, we're about to flip. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Catch on the flip side. Hey y'all, so um, I am just getting back on here really quick because um, my husband took the boys to church 
I am actually um, staying home because it's our first night with the chicks and I really just, I didn't want to leave them um, by themselves. So um, I decided, we kind of all decided that they would go to church and I would stay home um, and make sure that they do okay. So uh, anyways, uh, I actually took this opportunity uh, with everybody gone to jump in the shower, being outside uh, in our covered porch most of the day was really with that heat lamp going. I know Owen said that it was not hot out there, but y'all, it was ridiculously hot out there. So anyways, I was sweating up a storm all day being out there so much. So I feel so much better now and I'm just going to go check on the chicks every now and then. And we've had so much fun today with them. And the reason why I wanted to get back on here today, just now, um, is because I just, it was really neat on the way home, um, from the post office when we picked up the chicks, um, Ian was so excited. He, I wish I could have had it on tape or recording it when he said this, but he was like, Oh, it's our first pet. And he was just so excited. And part of me felt devastated and the other part of me felt really happy and excited and i'll tell you the reason i felt devastated is because he's almost 10 he'll turn 10 in september and i felt so bad that he's almost 10 and he's just not getting his first pet and some of you may think that that's horrible but i mean it's it's honestly it's a, it's a legit reason um my husband and i have allergies like really bad and Owen, I'm pretty sure, has allergies too. And so, um, it's, you know, it's not comfortable for us to have pets inside of our house. And to be, to go to other people's house, um, when they have animals, it's real uncomfortable for us. We usually come home with itchy eyes and runny nose and, um, to have to deal with that all the time. And that's even on medication. Like we take daily medication. I take both over the counter and prescription and, uh, so it's, you know, it's not the greatest of things, but so this is why it's such a big deal that we somehow convinced my husband to let us get chickens anyways. Um, so I just, I wanted to get on here and just say that I, I'm so excited that, um, and just, I just, I don't know. I, I had the words in my head earlier when I was thinking about this because, uh, when, just thinking about how excited Ian was about, about having his first pet and just about what a neat experience that is for a kid to have their first pet. And, um, anyways, I just thought I'd share that because, you know, it's, is a pretty neat experience to go through. And, um, I didn't think we'd ever get to experience that with our kids and just the excitement in his voice and everything was pretty neat. And the kids are pretty excited about this and they love those chicks. I mean, they have gone out there so many times today with me and without me um, to check on them. And um, Owen actually volunteered to clean the chick's um, pasty butt. Um, but when I said that I wanted to record it, he was like, oh, he didn't want to do it on video. So um, I said, well... I really did want to record it. That's probably, I shouldn't have done that. I should have just let him do it and not recorded it. But, um, you know, you live and learn. But, um, anyways, I'm, I'm just, I'm really excited to share this journey with you guys and, um, to share just not only the excitement of our first chickens, but it really is our first pet too. So, um, you know, it's just, it's really exciting for us. So, um, I know I said catch you on the flip side earlier, but, um, I had to get back on here with the boys gone and just share this with you guys about um, just the fact that we're really blessed by this and I'm just really excited. I know my husband probably isn't as excited as us, um, but I think he is probably excited that we're excited. So um, I think he he likes seeing the excitement in us. Um, so uh, yeah, so I hope that you guys will like this video if you like what you saw. And if you learned something, if you have any questions for us, um, feel free to comment. Uh, you know, we're learning on this. But if you do have questions, you know, feel free to ask. Um, subscribe to our channel if you want 
to have updates and everything, hit the bell button and uh, the little bell icon and, and you'll get updates on when we post our next video. So yeah, we'll catch you on the flip side, guys. Bye.